We're going camping, baby. That was blurry, but honestly, guys, we're in such a rush. We don't, we don't have time to care about the blur. We're not actually going camping. I'm heading off to Lucy and Frederick's yard again for a, another training camp to whip me into shape ahead of Babington. But this time, I'm not going alone. Oh, no, 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 no. You guys will already know who I'm going with. But come on, let's have a bit of suspense. Let's pretend you don't. Sorry, I'm like trying to do my last bit of packing. Lol. Part of the reason I'm going for a camp to rebuild that confidence that I have shattered at uh, Bicton. We're going to talk more about that because I had a bit of a realisation um, going to try other people's horses. Anywho, we will discuss when we have more time. We will also discuss the fact that I'm taking just Dee Dee. This was not the plan. Uh, yeah. Things haven't been going too smoothly recently, guys. But I will update you all once we're there. For the time being, I have stuffed the lorry literally to the rafters. I've hired one so that I can drive myself so that poor mum doesn't have to drive me down. And yeah, I just need my air jacket and a pony. And then we're good to go. I will see you in Wiltshire. Hopefully sunny Wiltshire. We made it. Good girl, Dee Dee, having a nice little graze, and da -da 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 -da. the infamous Lucinda Fredericks Arena, jam-packed full of scary exercises, but they're not going to be scary, guys, because this weekend is all about confidence. Hey, Dee Dee. So we're waiting for our special guest to arrive. No way. Guys, look at that. I promise, this wasn't timed. Come on, who could that be? Well, 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 we've got an Equitrek. Hey! Is that my favourite pony? It sure is. Um, I think just go up near mine and then we might move them in a bit. I'm a long beard. You are long. Look at you, big long girl. Oh, Dee says that better be my boyfriend, Banksy. You happy, Diddy? Da -da 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 -da. Who have we got next door? <gasps> it's Banksy from the telly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he needs a wee. And Tina from give the me, telly. Give me my Hello. Oh, oh sorry, me. Banks. Wow, look at these gigantic stables. Dee is tucking in. She says, This is good grub. Cheers. Cheers, Lucinda. How's my favourite? Courtesy of the Fredericks. Hey. Well, guys, Tina just asked how we're going to not replicate content, and then her camera died, so that's how. I've got a phone, right? <laughs> How right. Do this so we don't replicate duplicate content. What did you say? We're riding, we're riding oh, different we're horses, so we'll be fine. Different horses, so it won't be the same. Oh, thirsty work. Thirsty work, hungry work, more like I've literally not eaten anything other than Pringles. Righty ho! Sorry, guys, we had to go and do some jump clapsing because this morning, or something this morning, this afternoon, we're going to be doing like poles and flat worky kind of stuff, and then tomorrow is very exciting because there's going to be lots of jumping two lessons each and we've got a photographer we've got brands oh no we nearly got an empty bottle <laughs> I of saw you, food i saw you balancing that I was like, that's a really good yeah, idea i clearly got more talent than you mate you really have I'm balancing bottles anyway what's the time because i have currently had right this is so bad it's 2 25 and i've had about eight pringles <laughs> that's really what bad flavor? Plain, which I don't actually rate. Yeah. Uh, you should get a bit of. Do you know what? I've kind of gone off Pringles. Yeah. Um. Anyway, you guys guessed it. Why food to the rescue? T, could you open that for me? I, I thought you were going to say, "Could I show you my yeah, bottle?" And in the meantime, look at this. You can see who Why Food loves more, can't you? <laughs> T got like her own. Oh, sorry, that's the one flavour I don't like. Sorry. Isn't it? Berry. I like berry. Yeah. You crack on. Swaps you back. I got my own branded bottle. Yeah. Vanilla. Anyway, yeah. Why food to the rescue? You guys know the drill. If you want to get a ten percent discount, you can use my code, Tina. which is Elphic Dash YouTube. We're getting Tina's confused. Tina's easier to spell. Elphic's a test of your capabilities. Um, yeah, these do save me. Literally, like this. Genuinely, I've had eight Pringles maybe more than eight to be fair but we're now about to hop straight on a horsey and by the time I get to the stables I'll be able to down this boom nice and full how many vitamins and minerals Ooh. 26 or 28 26 <laughs> just testing your knowledge yeah, come on high you in fiber high in protein gluten free 
Oh God, I don't have that spiel. No added sugar. Oof. She knows it all. You can, you can tell why she got the personalised bottle sent to her and I didn't. Anyway, link's going to be down below, guys, if you want to head over and treat yourself. Event season's coming up. It is indeed. You don't want to be hungry swiftly. if you're nervous. Isn't it just? Anyway, so this is where we are. There's my little box that we hired. Different stables to last year. Oh, you're in the main yard. No, I was in. I was outside. It's because you're here. Oh. They're huge, they're very lucky ponies. They're enormous. And they're loving the house. We need to figure out who's going to ride first. You. Do you have a preference? <laughs> oh, okay, I'll ride first. Yeah, when you get to see Lucinda's style of teaching. Exactly. And then here we are. Banks and Dee Dee. Do you reckon they ever see like wifey bottles and think they're venting? Yeah, take me. Take me to that start box. Come on. She's like, no, look how smart she's she looks. time. She does look really smart, very white. No, that, that took a long time yesterday, didn't it, Didi? He says, bit, yeah, no, it's she's, cold. She's got a little bit extra insulation. But Dee wasn't meant to come. I do need to explain this to you guys. I, I was going to say, have you explained? Haven't yet, haven't yet. Why my favourite grey pony's here. Sorry, Jam. <laughs> Jam, if you're watching, we love you. Um, no, we'll explain after we've ridden and seen the accommodation. I'm really hot now. We're just doing our stretches ahead of our first ride. Good girl, Diddy. Good girl. So, I don't know how much I've mentioned this, guys. Honestly, I'm not doing these very well. It has been such a busy few days that I've kind of just been all over the place and don't know what I'm doing. As you can breathe out by the way I'm speaking now. Anywho, we have come back down to Wiltshire to stay with the lovely Team Fredericks. Come on. You may remember last year I came with both Didi and Jam Bam and we did like a full on prepping for badminton camp. <laughs> Dee's so half hardly doing this. I think it's because the treats are too small. Good girl. What's up? So we have come again, but of course, Tina and Banksy are off to badminton next year. So we invited them along and they said yes. It's very exciting. Ages ago thinking, yeah, that'll be fine. It's ages away and it's come around so it's quickly. It's come around really quick, hasn't it? Oh, yeah. But we're hoping that Lucinda is going to absolutely grill us. Well, Although, we we've both come a bit of, for a confidence point of view, haven't we? Yeah, we both haven't actually been able to put in as much time and effort over the winter no, as we, we had really haven't. originally planned to stroke coke too. Ooh, that's snazzy. Isn't that really smart? So soft. So soft, they're really nice. Really, really and nice. light. Yeah, no, really, really smart. These are the expert bits, but I wasn't nice. Um, Lucky exactly that. So we've come for like an absolute crash course. We're here for quite a while. We're here. It's now Wednesday and we're staying till Saturday. Is it Wednesday today? I know. I thought I was going to be on Friday. I said to Rob, see you Friday. I forgot we're staying three nights. <laughs> More fun. We'll see. We'll see how much hard work it is. Yeah, do you I want to get down? It might be like the All-Star Academy. I might get sent home early. <laughs> Oh, savage. Uh, but yeah, there's going to be all sorts going on. Today is going to be more like vloggy style. Thank you for tacking up my pony. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, some like proper lesson format tomorrow, I'm thinking. So I might just film the lessons tomorrow. And then, as we said, potentially going cross country schooling on Friday, weather dependent. And then Saturday, we'll probably just have for ourselves, won't we? Go for a nice hack. I really like how light this is. Yeah, they're really, really Lovely. nice. Really nice. Really right, I'm going to actually help Tina tack up and then she's going to film me for my oh, flat work and pole lesson. I was riding Dee, that's why I was tacking up. Oh, mate. I thought we were doing pony swap. What? Oh my God, we actually could. No, 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 we're Badminton, come on. Come on, Tina. Saturday we could have fun then. Yeah, we could do. Before we get home. Testing, testing, one, two, it helps if you press record. Right, what do you aim to achieve from today, Megan? Just to be like Vallegro. Oh. She says she wants to um, turn D into Vallegra in this lesson. <laughs> so she's going for new stirrup work today. <laughs> what happened, Meg? I'm trying to pull them up. I don't know how you manage that. Or we'll pull okay. them down, either. Do I need two hands? Yes, please. <laughs> Thank you. Did you get tense in the walk? Yeah, we just get short in the walk. Okay, so as you're walking now, try and open your, th open your thighs. Okay. And just make them soft right now she's walked differently yeah. straight away she walked differently i've gotten so bloody tense i noticed when i was trying horses the other day i'm like this so with with your bum just relax it okay and let your inner thigh slightly roll open and make your seat bones just heavy Okay. onto her back. 
So you've not, you, there's no grip yeah. with your leg. Yeah. All right? And you've got to slightly try and move your hips. There you go. How's that? Yeah, good. Let your hip move. Your hips move with her back. So it's slightly one forward, one back, one forward. So you just sort of <laughs> roll a bit Yeah. with her. Now she's not tense. Yeah. Okay. Because the first thing that we would do is grip. Yeah. And you don't want to grip. Yeah. You want to relax into her back. Tight horses, very often, people would take the leg off. Yeah. And, and do a little bit of a, this position. Yeah. Okay. But actually, for the, the sort of horses we ride, they're not, most of them are not bred for dressage. Yeah. And they're fit. Um, and they're ready to run. Yeah. Um, and they probably need a little bit of help and security. Because if our horses are so light off the leg, I think, having done the pure dressage a long time ago, <laughs> you can't ride them yeah, jumping. Yeah, no, yeah, 100%. If they're so light off the leg, they're, in, they're too sharp to ride. Yes, they've got to be off the leg. Yeah. But when I did the dressage, I couldn't believe how sensitive and light they, the dressage, the pure dressage riders train their horses because it, for them, it's got to look effortless. If the horse is so light to the leg, so light to the hand, it's... It's I so easy to give them the wrong message, isn't too it? Too hard yeah. because we're not perfectly in balance. Yeah. We try to be, but we're not perfect is slightly closer to her yeah. tummy. Yeah. You feel that? Mm hmm And yeah, you think, don't sit with toes out, don't sit with toes out, but but you've got to cuddle yourself, yeah. you know, around her and make her feel secure. You've got to sort of cuddle her and, and be connected to her. Mm -hmm. Your inside shoulder needs to come back. So wherever her shoulders are going to go, so do your shoulders. Okay. Good, good, lovely. Yeah? Yeah. Now she's not tense at all. No. Okay. Good. And then you can make the circle a bit smaller. Good. Let the outside of the neck stretch a little bit. Okay. Just stretch. There you go. You feel that? Yeah. She's got a nice little walk. Yeah, she, she has. She over track by a lot. No. But she's correct. But we always get like a, a six or a 6.5 for a walk. Yeah. If she doesn't jog, you should be up for a seven. Yeah. And quietly trot, lower leg down. So when you go forward, you've got to think about her um, uh, your inside leg, good, has to be longer than your outside leg, and then you'll probably be straight. Okay. Okay? Good. All right, she's nicely in the hand there, isn't she? Yeah. Very nice. Lovely. Girl. Don't wriggle the fingers. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Your fingertips need to stay. Your, your hands are around the reins, okay. not in your fingers. That's totally different. Yep, she's solid down there into the reins. Yeah. That's lovely. Yeah. Yeah? Good. Okay, so then don't wriggle. Do you feel it happen? That a bit. left hand wrist. Right, okay. Got a bit excited. <laughs> right, how does that feel? Any different? Yeah, it feels weird doing it. But yeah, it does. Does it feel a bit more solid? Yeah. Like a bit more heavy? Everything should be a bit heavier. Yeah. Right, your bum heavier in the saddle. So you're pushing, you're, la you're pressing into her back. Yeah. All right, because she likes that. Yeah, well, that's, she feels just a bit more, like, secure now. Good. Now you're being able to push as nicely as you can. That's a lovely working trot. Yeah? yeah. And it's, it's balanced. Good. And then change the rein again. Oh, no, it's really simple. Diagonal first. Bend second. 
direction third. Make sure your inside shoulder's back. Think about your right hand, your right ankle, your right toe. No wriggle wriggles. Good. Yeah? Happy yeah. with that? Yeah. Right, let's see what happens if you walk for eight strides and then trot. Okay. Don't Not wriggle. Like so as soon as I said, watch your diagonal. As soon as I said walk, everything started to change. Yeah. Yeah, so you got all tight and all sort of funny in your position. Short rein, long arm. So you let your elbow just reach to her mouth a little bit. Oh. Reach to her mouth. Ah, there you go. Okay. This way you can have a tiny bit more inside position. Now that means round that inside leg. Turn your toe, turn your toe. Go on. Keep your lower leg forward, but turn, lift your little toe up on the right and allow her to walk. Relax your seat. Lovely. And then trot. Good. That was nice, yeah? Yeah. Feeling that you can manoeuvre the muscles either side of her neck in front of her shoulder blades. Okay. All right, that's enough. Good. And this, this way, just do, literally one stride. One stride. Yeah, one. Straight and in. One. Straight and in. One. Straight and in. Or even two. <laughs> just so that she becomes more pliable. Yeah. And you get more bend to the left than you do to the right. Yeah, yeah. So, I want more bend to the right than you do to the left. Right, straight, left. And if you do two strides in each position, it gives you that little bit more room. Two, two, and right. And straight. Good. That's better. Yeah. Yeah? Good. Now, at the same time as doing that, you're going to go into canter. Okay. So, obviously, when you get to the inside. Yeah. Okay. Hold of that. Ah. Okay. Nice. Dig a little bit up. Good. Yeah. Gently open your thigh and only use your inside lower leg to ride her forward. O open your knee. Open your knee. Sit to the inside. Okay, your inside leg needs to be long. Open your toe. Now relax your elbow, one, then the other. Relax, one, then the other. Yeah. As soon as you hold her tight, she'll have a problem. Yeah. Okay. Slight shoulder in. And that tiny little bit of angle should, if you can get marginal shoulder four, shoulder in, it will keep her more relaxed and more supple. Right. Turn your body, because you've lost her around that corner. Do you feel it? Yeah. Shorter rein, longer arm. Good. Short. Turn your shoulders. Turn your shoulders. Just let it relax. Whoa, whoa, soften, soften. Whoa, whoa, soften, soften. Whoa, whoa, soften, soften. So you've got to... Slightly allow her to take a tiny longer stride. Yeah. But she can't because she's got her ass in. Her yeah. thumb is too far in. Yeah. So her inside I hind know. leg needs to move a little bit towards your right buttock. So turn your body, sit to the inside. Really let that inside leg relax down. Relax it. Don't forget to half hold. So all over there, when I said put your sit to the inside, then you forgot to half hold. Yeah. If you count, one, two, three, four. Whoa, whoa, give, give. Whoa, whoa, give, give. Flex, flex, give, give. For give, it's just like a rubber band for her. She can't, you don't want to drop her. Yeah. Yeah. But it's like a slightly stronger, Elastic band and a lighter elastic yeah. band. Yeah. That's lovely. That's nice. Keep it there. Good. Just try and do them. Ooh. Doesn't matter. Nice trot, though. Yeah. Into canter. Into canter. Good. 
and count slowly and that will just relax her but your left leg is the one the inside leg that keeps her going good don't forget your half holds whoa whoa soften soften and it's literally just short short rain long arm it's just breathing for you slowly as well yeah okay good now she's not pulling as much as she no and she's back Oof, sorry guys got um distracted after riding because i had to film tea so we've both had our lessons now it's getting a bit later in fact we need to get off to the airbnb it's 5 30. oh my word okay so we're gonna feed the ponies and then head off to the airbnb random sock but had a fabulous first lesson and look at this little chocky reward yes please but very happy with Dee she was a good girl she's not particularly fit because well we'll go into it later anyway let me get my feed sorted and then uh, we can get going and we're back guys are you ready for the cutest little tour I want to move in a little bit it's so nice firstly though let's um let's just take a little seat oh I haven't told you guys about why Dee's here oh We'll do it with a cup of tea. So, yes. chin chin, <laughs> and then you have the tour, and then we're um, we're gonna get Domino's. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> oh my god, that's so needed. So yes, was originally just planning on taking Jam Bam. Sorry, I'll get you out of shot so you can actually just chill on your phone. <laughs> um, it's like lovely pictures you took. Oh, see how I good basically to try and rebuild my confidence after victim. I felt like I really needed to come with jam, so that was always the plan, and then tea was always gonna come along, and it was gonna be fantastic, and Dee Dee was gonna stay at home and do like training at home. I've got other lessons booked for her to go to, so thought it was going to all go swimmingly well, and then about a week ago, jam started not looking 100%. Um, so I went to have a lesson with her and ended up getting off because she just didn't feel 100%. She wasn't like hopping lame or even like lame as such, but just stepping short and obviously know her so well. I've had her since she was three and I could just tell she wasn't right. So kind of been umming and ahhing. I've had a lot of physio done with her and was like, what's wrong? Like, is it muscular? What is it? And although she's improved, and to be honest, like she probably could have been ridden through it, absolutely did not want to play that game with her. Like I don't want to cause any additional injury and because we don't actually know what's caused it and she isn't, I wouldn't say she's completely 100% right now, to be honest. I decided that Dee Dee can come along because I'll still learn absolutely loads with her and quite frankly, she loves a party. So Jam Bam is currently at home, chilling. She's got physio again tomorrow. And yeah, I'm just keeping absolutely everything crossed that it is just some muscular tightness. Hopefully she's like slipped in the field or something like that. I literally don't want to think about the possibility of it being anything soft tissue, to be honest. So I'm keeping everything crossed that she's tight in her shoulder. She's stepping a little bit short in front we'll get her treated some more, she can do some walking out and then we'll be back on track. That's the plan in my head, but that is the reason that Dee Dee has come solo and Dee Dee's come at all to be honest. Anyway. I'm pleased to see my favorite cream. You baby. are, you are. <laughs> and like, it is nice to have Dee here because I have been struggling with her at home. She's been a little bit tense and just like. And also like you say, like, cause you know her like the back of your hand. Yeah. You don't always have as many lessons on her. No, as you would do no, so. that is so true. So no, it's really nice. And I really enjoyed my lesson today. You're gonna so. give her the chance to beat Jam at Babington. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we need to do a wager between oh, the Jam and Banksy. Mm. Hopefully Jam's All three completions. Go. All three completions. And, and Jam going, yeah, that'd I be a good want, start. I just want Jam to actually go, <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Are you ready for oh, the Oh, how tour? It's gorgeous. What, Baptist? The Baptist Cottage in Beautiful. Great Chevrol, I think. Is that easy? Chevrol? Not Chevrol. sure, but where are we near? Does that make sense? The Devizes. 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 I like that name. Right, ready for a house tour. All right, all right, all right. Oh, we've got a 
T, we need to do an unboxing. <laughs> this was, this just made me chuckle, guys, and I want to show you. So the television, the te why well, just call it a television? The TV is in there. Horse quest socks, as you can see. Um, so this is a little lounge, shall we say? I like that lamp. <laughs> and then we come through here. Look at this. I just imagine spending a Christmas here. Oh, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> I know you said well done me for finding, but this is actually Hobbit that found this because she's the oh, ultimate. I know she loves searching. I've not been that here yet. She wants come really. Mm, oh. I don't know. She just likes searching for stuff. So, sorry, guys. This is the most... remember. Um, <laughs> come down backwards. Let's come down backwards. It's slippery. Mate, this is steep. Hang on, I'm gonna get up without filming. Okay. <gasps> Okay, so this is the mezzanine. Beautiful. A lovely spot for some reading, we were told. Can you read too or not? Do they teach you reading in Cornwall? They do bloody teach you to read in Cornwall. <laughs> do you want to know something fun? Don't. I wasn't recording. I'm oh, tired. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome oh. to the house tour. Guys, I've full on just done an entire house tour without recording. I can't believe I've just done that. And look at this, the master suite. Oh, we did the best tour ever. We spoke about the hangers. It was incredible. I, I mentioned the bowl. We spoke about the Aztec styles. We did an awesome keys there. Nice picture. Okay, so then we come back down. <laughs> this is, this is fun. I love doing tours twice. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so here's the kitchen for a second time. Beautiful, beautiful. Baptist Church, this is called this place, guys. There's some some butter. Did you do a double press because the red light's on? Oh. <laughs> oh evidence. Guys, the plot thickens. <laughs> what have I filmed? What haven't I filmed? Maybe I don't know. I haven't press. seen that you haven't even drunk. Oh, I know. <laughs> right. I'm gonna quickly, we're gonna like there we go guys, look. Lounge, beautiful. <laughs> Bathroom. There we go. Absolute legend. And then this is Tina's room. And you might have seen this twice. You might not have done. Tell you what I need though, is a big fat Domino's. And a videographer. <laughs> right, I'm signing off now. Live, laugh, love you. hungry. Bye. Be quite useful. It'd be nice to give a yes. lesson on. Yeah. Um, and he's very rideable. Yeah. And you know, he's used to being lots here. I'm excited. Look ahead, look ahead. Right, so where were you looking? <laughs> At the poles. Yeah, she was looking down.